Beach 40 double sideband transceiver part 5. Today I'll add an extra feature, a fine tuning control. You really need it. This radio covers 150 kilohertz span, 7050 to above 7.2, in just 180 degrees rotation of the tuning capacitor. That makes tuning really finicky. And bear in mind, on SSB, you need to be within 50 hertz or less to be spot on frequency. It only needs just a few components, and I'll draw you the circuit in a moment. The circuit is simple to draw. This is the ceramic resonator. And that's the rest of the oscillator circuitry. Uh, no changes there. Now on this side of the ceramic resonator you've got your tuning capacitors. I've got two in parallel because I'm using two sections. One 60 picofarad, the other is 160 so there's uh, 220 all up. No change there. Now the first new component is 10 picofarad. Um, little disc ceramic capacitor. And here a diode. Uh, a power diode, one in 4002 or similar. Resistor, that's 27k. Potentiometer, that is 100k. And the top of the potentiometer goes to your positive rail. Um, so what happens is that it varies the, as you adjust the fine tuning control, it varies the potential on the diode and that adjusts its capacitance. The range isn't all that great but it's enough to slightly change it. So that's your main tuning capacitor and that's your fine tuning. Lima, BK3, UCL, calling CQ, CQ, which is my native, CK3, UCL, Vector Kilo 3, Uniform, Charlie Lima, CK3, UCL, calling CQ40, listening to that we had that earlier on. Noise with our bat at the uh, coast. And and uh, a splash, maybe. Maybe in the. Uh, uh, oh, uh, uh, fishing for uh, salmon or herring there, uh, Matty Over. K2WI. To submit news for inclusion in sessions, please email it to news at arnsw.org.au by the end of business on Friday. You can help us with presentation by writing your news item in the first person and limiting it to about one A4 page in the usual red box. WI, we now continue with this evening's news. And the Radio Home an experiment of three. And they'll be starting the new year with a bang. Well, not with a bang, but a meeting. The usual meeting on the first Tuesday of the month falls on New Year's Day. So the meeting will go ahead. Instead of the usual location in Putney, the meeting will be held at the headquarters of Amateur Radio New South Wales at 66 Quarry Road Jewel, starting at the usual time at 7 pm and finishing at 9 pm. So, Oh, I'll send an FT-847. I bought that quite some time ago. I bought it primarily to go away with. I've got this idea that maybe well, when we retire we might do a bit of touring around the place. So it would be a nice little radio to take away. Uh, 